So this is Bleed Heart Floral Farm and Design. It's a cut flower farm. It's not far from Mazeppa. I also do design studio, but yeah, all of this is where I'm growing flowers for wholesale clients, like florists, um, my CSA, and then any weddings. I do like a small, small amount of weddings every year. Allie Koopenbender spends much of her day in the garden and she sells to florists. You definitely don't have to be buying from a local farmer to get local flowers. Ask your local florists if they're, where they're sourcing their flowers from and request that um, they start buying local flowers. There's lots of um, flower farmers in the area that are selling high quality cut flowers. Allie says she is pushing for people to not forget about their local growers. Local flowers are an alternative. Over 80% of flowers um, sold in the United States are imported, um, but just trying to let people know that like locally grown flowers are an option. It's not just wild flowers or prairie flowers that people picked out of a field. Like we are professionally growing these. It takes a lot of effort and they're also super beautiful because they're not shipped for weeks and sit in chemical quarantines. There's no pesticide regulations on uh, cut flowers in the United States. So do they last longer? They or? do last longer. Okay. I have um, CSA clients that will say that their um, bouquets last up to two weeks. She has a large variety and says business is going great. These are some dahlias um, for florists. Um, yeah, these are some of the most expensive <laughs> flowers that I grow um, because as you can see, they have little bags on them um, because every single bug, it's their favorite thing to snack on. So they're very labor intensive but they're also very, very beautiful. And there are pumpkins as well that you can buy this Sunday at Bleed Heart Floral Farm and Designs Open House. Um, I started growing pumpkins actually because my son was born um, in the beginning of October. And so we have like a pumpkin carving birthday party for him. But um, if anyone that has ever grown pumpkins knows that you get a lot of pumpkins from a pumpkin patch. So we have way more than we need for his birthday party. So I started selling them um, wholesale to florists and then also to the public during our open house. We have all the details about that open house on our website, that's kttc.com. And you can check it out on Sunday. It's so pretty up there and you can get those beautiful pumpkins. She has so many different varieties, like varieties I've never heard of. So it's a lot of fun and it's going to be the perfect weekend for it. Again, all those details at kttc.com. Just click Midwest Access.